<laughs> Next column. So we're on column three now. Let's begin with a series of been meaning to watch and almost started like three times where I've been waylaid, and that is Space Dandy. Exactly yeah. the same. I've always, I've seen, I think I've seen the first episode about twenty times, and I never, <laughs> I never get past I don't it. Know what it is? Uh, I, I know it's from the same people who did Cowboy Bebop, and that's the hmm. thing. You like, uh, I, it's yeah. I know it does have quite a uh, a, a big fan base because hmm. I've heard a lot of people say it's uh, almost as comfy as Cowboy Bebop. Basically, like okay. It's because it is just a guy going round and chilling around the universe, and it looks cool. I just, I have season one on the Blu-ray, but I I haven't got round to watching it yet. But on the Blu-ray, on the Blu-ray. Next up, I will be gen. So this was one I suspected Tim might have watched. I don't know why, which is case case closed or Detective Conan. No, um, never seen it. So. A little fun... I, I'm assuming you guys haven't either. No. No. So, a little fun fact about Case Closed. Uh, earlier, we were, we were laughing about One Piece. <laughs> Case Closed has over 1,100 episodes. Um, because it's... Essentially, Case Closed is the anime equivalent of, like, Midsummer Murders or, like, a detective mystery show. <laughs> it's because... An anime it... adaptation of Midsummer <laughs> <laughs> It's a brilliant... <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, me do something. Oh, anime Miss Marple, man. But yeah, it's about Detective Conan, uh, who's a boy who solves loads of mysteries. Um, I know people do genuinely love the. Si- I mean, it's been going on this long. It can't. It can't have not had a fan base, I guess. But uh... that's what I love: an anime series that's a chore. <laughs> to be fair, I think whilst it's ongoing, I think like cases last like eight to ten episodes. So I think it is like a. You can dip in, you know. Uh, next up, maybe Tom's seen this, I don't know. No Game, No Life. But I have seen one or two episodes, I couldn't get into it. Ah, which is... But it, it's absolute trash, I'll tell you that now. Uh, it, oh. Not as in, like, it's bad, I mean, it's trashy. Degenerate. I mean, it is I mean I'm not... Uh... Okay, okay. And okay, I, I, you... I, don't, I don't want to typecast Tom. As the uh, as no, 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 no. which the DJ anime is, I'm just putting it's, on. Okay. Uh, I mean, you know, uh. <laughs> no, for uh, for legal reasons, uh, I am <laughs> just going to say that. <laughs> no, um, I've I, I I do I do genuinely know that sort of a running meme is that people really want no game no life season two, so they must have a fan base. Mm. Right, next up is Agretuko, uh, which I have seen the first season of. Is that the one with, is that the angry... Yeah, ah, the, yeah. One, the red and panda. The karaoke one. Yeah, it's honestly, it, it's so good. Now, yeah, I, I need to finish it. I want to say there's like, there was an OVA series as well before Netflix bought it. So oh, if you happen okay. to have watched that, I guess, but the Netflix one is basically like a updated version. Um, kind of funny though, the next one is called Pim. <laughs> uh, um, also, uh... also a Gretzico, Dan, when you say you need to finish it, there are five seasons. Oh, there is five. Oh, I, I just thought it was just the Netflix one. So I... Well, Netflix uh... has five seasons. But yeah, I, I didn't realise until recently <laughs> I saw a post that was like, hey, season five is out. It was like, good Christ, I remember seeing season one and didn't know. I think it was. I think it was very well received. Yeah, it's it's um, yeah, it's about everyday life, isn't it? Of people. Yeah. Like, oh yeah, you're right. It's five. It's, uh, <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, it's oh it's a, well. So the the cool thing about Gretico, it's a Sanrio character, so it's in the same universe as Hello Kitty, technically. Yeah, I, oh, know. I didn't know that. Um, that well, there's there's uh, one of the later episodes in season one. She's at a bar drinking, and someone mentions like, "Hey, are you a Sanrio character?" And she says something like, "Ah, sometimes, yeah." And sort um. of the the implication is she's an office lady, and sometimes a cute Sanrio character. Agretico is cute. Uh, next up is uh, "Your Name" by Makoto Shinkai. I haven't seen the series though. <laughs> oh, it uh. never gets old, does it? Um, no, uh, uh, have, no. have you guys seen your name? No, no I, I want to. I really it want is, 
It is not gen- the gay one with the uh, with the uh, what's his name Timothy Chalamet and oh no that's call me by your name. Uh, oh yeah, I I I don't I, I I don't know who that is, but yeah, that's the Joker. Uh, they, they do. The guy um, from Dune. Fucking hell, you seen Dune? Dune? Yeah. Oh right. Oh yeah, I remember. Yeah, but no, I've I've not heard the movie sadly. Um, but no, your name, uh, Mokoto Shinkai. It's it's a beautiful movie. It is genuinely, um, much like a lot of Shinkai's work, very fucking sad. Um, yeah. At the end, I mean, there's this weathering with you five centimeters per second. At the end, well, weathering with you is a bit more optimistic, but five centimeters per second. The thing is, is... oddly, I've seen the Garden of Words. And I've seen Weathering with you, but hmm. I've not seen your name. It is so. very good. Uh, right. Next up is Lupin the Third. Um, okay. Okay. So, uh, can I say, I know it's a series, but I've seen the movie, which is the Castle of Cagliostro. That is fine, you... because I was about to say, whilst there is a series of Lupin the Third, uh, it's more well known for its movies, actually. They're kind of a bit of like capery kind of thing so, i love it it's so i mean that's the only one i've seen i i've not it. seen it's any great. so dan might be on his own there tom tim have oh. you no no i have seen one through two but i haven't seen three. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, th- this this is Funny the reason guy. this is the reason where one of youtube's best comedy channels i know yeah Comedy tortoise. Uh, uh, laugh toys. Oh. <laughs> I, I, would, I, would, I had that in the back pocket since I saw it on the list. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> right, next one is Kaguya Sama. Love is War. Uh, I've not seen it. I I know everyone knows Chica is popular, the pink haired. Oh, girl. I wish I saw it. Yeah, everyone loves her. Everyone loves isn't, her. isn't it based on the guy from, from Tekken, Kaguya Mishima? Uh, or um, keeps coming. They keep coming. Or also, they do. Ka- That's what they keep me for. Kaguya was also the final villain in Naruto Shippuden, the the moon uh, moon rabbit lady girl woman. Uh, yeah, it it looks comfy. I haven't watched it. And Apparently, Tom... a movie recently came out, didn't it? Uh, I yes. think it was very well received. Very nice. well received. Um, wow. Very popular anime. No, next one. Uh, I I have not seen any of, which is Sailor Moon. Oh well, I've seen some episodes, but I've seen have a shit ton of Sailor Moon. Thought, I've seen yeah. more than enough to tick this one off. Yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna, I was gonna stare at Tim then, like. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what, I, what does that mean? I I know <laughs> I know Tim is a fan of Sailor Moon. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's good. I love Sailor Moon. Yeah, Dan, you've you've seen. I can say I've seen plenty enough of it too. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm. All right. Who's your favourite Sailor Shanshi, Dan? Uh, Sailor Mars. Oh. Okay. Well, we'll 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 give Dan the benefit of the doubt. I'll I will <laughs> say I I'll give him a point. Uh, next up, I actually bizarrely started watching the live action adaptation on Netflix before realizing this was an anime, which is Erased. Um, if it's the one I'm thinking of, I think it is. It's it's a bit time travelly. It's sort of about a boy traveling back in time, but well, a guy that travels back in time, but he he travels back to his body as a boy, but oh. he has to he has to like solve something, I think, and there's a bit of timey wimey stuff um i watched a bit of the live action thing but i i've not watched much of it funnily enough i did actually tape this on my vhs <laughs> uh, but it all got erased oh which is i mean if you've managed uh, uh, vhs if you've managed to like tape erased that's a that's that's that must be a niche anime scene like anime but they like release it on vhs for you to watch in a vhs player I, I could see a really small niche doing that. Yeah. Right, next up, a series I haven't seen either, Soul Eater. I've heard good things, um, but I've just never got around to it. Does it come before or after Soul Calibur? Uh, it is before, because it's uh, alphabetically. Or, no, after. Or Soul after. Reaver. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah. not before. Soul um, Reaver. Yeah, Legacy of Cain. I'm guessing no one's seen Soul Eater. No. 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 Right, one I have seen, uh, ReZero. Uh, I've seen season one of that. It's it's pretty nice. It is it is an isekai. 
Um, if if you happen to collect anime merch, you've definitely seen <laughs> Rem. You've, yeah, she, yeah, she's yeah. the blue haired maid girl. Um, I dare you to find a sort of a statue maker who hasn't made a Rem statue. Uh, to the point, I have a Rem statue. You know, it is the dog girl version, which is best version. She, Anyone? Yeah, there's like a million versions of her in statue fans. She's like, she's almost like. Hatsumi Miku, isn't she? Oh like, yeah, it's almost. It's, versions, uh, not, quite there. not quite there. I'm. You haven't seen Re Zero, Tom? No. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. I I know about it. Or I'm very aware of it. Cool. Uh, next up is <laughs> next up is a series I almost started watching, um, but I I just never got around to again. Is Banana Fish, uh, which I know is about. It's sort of set. It's set in Tokyo, and I think. Someone's brother either dies or goes missing and leaves a mysterious note about a gang. And it's sort yeah. of about gangs, sort of. And I think the last message he left him just said, Banana Fish. And... Now, I've I've never seen Banana Fish, but I've seen it, like, crop up a few times. And every time I see it, I always think it was named by, like, a lol so random girl from the mid noughties. <laughs> Well, Lol, banana fish. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so random. When I, because it's on Amazon Prime, and I, I scrolled past it once or twice, and genuinely the first time thought it was like a kids show, as in like <laughs> it's banana fish, and it's like Yay. a fish that looks like a banana or something. I'm guessing you guys haven't seen it either. No. Right on to the next one, Kion. Absolutely. Oh, I don't think anyone here has seen oh, Kion. I... Definitely not. No, no, no. Kion is. It's so good. Seen it all. I actually haven't, but yeah, Tom has. Well, it's I, phenomenal. I've I, seen the best bit. The best bit's when Yui plays Freebird. <laughs> uh, and actually, another series that is really good, both seasons, and the movie is really, really good as well. Uh, super comfy. I, I love Kion. Is, is there a K off button? <laughs> <laughs> love the movie. It was when I was living in London it came out, so I really appreciate. Ah. It. Yeah, it's it's very comfy. If you haven't seen K-On and you like cute girls playing cute instruments in a cute band, you know what? Watch Watchy the Rock. There you go. Ooh, yeah. oh, <laughs> ooh, ooh, Thomas on the fucking flame war here. Thomas is trying an argument with himself. Next up uh, is so either the old or the new version of Yurisei Yatsura, um, which is that uh, cute blue-haired girl in the tiger-striped bikini who's an alien who comes to Earth. I've seen the, I've seen the British dub. <laughs> so there, there was, uh, if any of you are Eurasa Yatsura fans, uh, the BBC in the UK did do a dub of Eurasa Yatsura, and it's, it's gold. It is incredible. There's like a compilation out there. Um, but yeah, so I'm guessing... I... None of us have like watched no, it. Though. No, no, no. I'm going to watch it. I'm going hmm. to watch the the re like the remake of it now. I think nice. I bought. It's funny because I bought a statue of Lum. Uh, ah, so I know, wonder I'm, why. Uh, she's cute. She's cute. It's the same. What attracts Tom as... to an anime? Mm, <laughs> it's the uh. same creature as uh, Inuyasha, which we... ah, oh, there no. you go. Yeah. Right, next up is Future Diary. Is that Mirai Nikki, I want to say? Yes, it is. It right, is. I, I I've it. not seen it. Um, um, me neither. It's like Battle Royale. Uh, mixed yeah. With death I know it um, was a popular cosplay for a while. The, like, oh, yeah, yeah. From it. Um, the, the girl from it. Um, uh, I forgot her name now. Jesus Christ. But um, she I basically... Don't think it was Jesus Christ. <laughs> Uh, she popularized Yandere girls. Uh, ah, after that yeah. series, uh, everyone mm. wanted to be everyone oh. wanted Yandere girls in their series. And no bad could come from that, right? Have have <laughs> you have you seen Future Diary, Tom? Yes, all of it. Oh, but... sweet. Hey, there you go. Yeah. Right. Next up, honestly, the, uh, column three is filled with anime. It's like, oh, I, I need to watch this. This is on my list. It's soon. Is uh, Laid Back Camp uh, or Yuru Camp. I, I haven't watched it yet, but it looks so no, comfy. Yeah, but... It's just cute girls going camping. Like, does, it sound, does it sound comfy? Does it sound comfy or does it sound laid back? Uh, ooh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. 
Uh, right, I'm guessing none of us have watched it. No. Next no, up, no. next up is definitely one I'm very interested in, which is SSSS Gridman, which is so it's an interesting one. It's technically an anime adaptation of a Tokusatsu, uh, which is a sort of Power Rangers, Kamen Rider, Super Sentai kind of thing. Um, it is based off the Gridman series, but they made it into an anime, basically. They have changed it a little bit as well, but it's kind of a mech anime, kind of a tokusatsu, but it's more mech-based. So imagine Power Rangers, but they usually just fight in their mechs as opposed to, you know, hand-to-hand. It looks really good. There's also uh, Triple S Diners on, and there's a new one coming out as well, I think. Uh, next one is Domestic Girlfriend. I've heard of. I don't know much about, sadly. Well, I know is it's the pinnacle of trash. Um, it's about oh. like a guy. Hey, who, knows. Who, his ex girlfriend moves in with him because she becomes his stepsister, and he starts sleeping with her again. Oh, it's God. like all like, oh, oh, the like hentai, from what I've heard. Um, oh. Oh. I know. I know. Um, trash taste. Basically, <laughs> say yeah. It's like it's ju- it's just the pinnacle of trash anime. Uh, wow. Yeah. Uh, but just to clarify, you haven't seen it, Tom. No, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh. Right. Uh, no, ne- I next up, I watched the first two episodes of, by I just never continued, Love Live. Uh, it is about cute girls, in, cute girls in high school <clears throat> being part of a idol group. Um, I know it's really popular. I think I watched Sunshine, the start of Sunshine, I think. It is on YouTube, I think. The... Um, the the you know it's like officially on YouTube but I never got into it. Um, I'm more of a bang dream D4 DJ kind of guy. Uh, I'm I I know none of you have watched it so. Um, moving on to Cycle Pass, which I have watched. Uh, it is well I've watched season one. This is another one where I've heard season two is like really falls off hard in terms of quality. Mm. But Psycho that's Pass... one of the things. Yeah, I I I've heard good things, but you know if that's the thing. If you feel invested and then you hmm. you feel put off. Well, I I, I mean I think it? season one can and should be watched on its own anyway. As in okay. like it's it's okay. it's a full story. Season two is literally just like a couple of years later they happen to do this. But you know, oh right right okay that's not too bad. Uh, it, it's a very it's quite a. It's quite a gritty thing. Uh, basically, it's set in the future where crimes are... No, people have criminal quotients. So they, you know, are under suspicion before they even commit a crime. Bit minority report, kind of. Uh, very good. Very dark. Very good. Next up, When They Cry. Um, oh, what's the... Uh, is Not clan... No, what's it called? Higurashi. Higurashi. Well, Higurashi, When They Cry. I've not watched it. I know it's a popular older anime, kind of a slice yeah. of life. Oh well, that I, I say Future Diary popularized Young Day Erase, but I think this might have actually before it. Oh, have you seen uh, When They Cry, Tom? Uh, I've seen a few episodes, but I, I I think it's one of those that an episode is a self-contained thing, and then it goes back in time again. So I mean, oh, different okay. happens. Like it's very dark, but no. I oh, yeah. No, wait. I'm confusing. The, sorry. Yeah. No. Higurashi is the like really gory one, isn't it? Didn't we see? Wait. A few episodes yeah. In, I swear. No, I swear we watched like three or four. Sorry, I don't know why. I thought this was along the lines of Clanad, where it's like a cute slice of life. No, sorry. No, Higurashi's. Oh, oh. It's it's a lot, man. It's we we watched like three episodes, and I. Oh, the, there's... Yeah, it's a lot. Uh, talking about a lot of episodes, next up is Bleach. Uh, mm. Now, Bleach I've seen. I, yeah, I've... Bleach I like. Bleach I've, is... I fucking love me some Bleach. I've watched all of original Bleach, uh, including the filler arcs. Uh, Unfortunately, I've also witnessed the Bound Saga. Yeah. Um, I've not watched any of the movies, you know. I I hmm, I want to say I watched one of the movies and it was very bad, so I didn't watch any of the other ones. Oh, there was I think there was one I watched whichever movie um, Toshiro shows up in. And ah, it's, yeah. It, like, uh, yeah. 
I, I, I think it's not worth it. from what I've heard, I think there's one of them that's considered quite good, and the rest are like. Mm. Uh, yes, but yeah, yeah, I've also yeah. watched. I've started watching Thousand Year Blood War. So far, I've only watched like three episodes. But good lord, a lot happens. I I'm in, impressed. Also, animation for the new series is oh, oh it's so yeah, good. Yeah, I've been rewatching it to try and catch up, ready for the uh, for the new one. And <laughs> Old Bleach is not very well made. No, it's aged quite considerably, but it's still fun to watch. Yeah, there's. Uh... There's some nice animated fights. Next up, I've not seen... I, I know quite a bit about it, which is New Game, which is a bunch of cute girls who make a video game company and there's lots of implied Yuri and there's there's different types of girls for ev- all tastes. And have you, have you seen New Game, Tom? No. Uh, it's uh, kind of a slice of life, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's just like a comfy anime about girls making video games. Uh, next up is Zombieland Saga. Uh, another one I know has become quite popular. I've never seen it. Uh, I, I'm... it has that really funny scene, doesn't it, where the girl leaves the house and then a truck hits. Oh, oh, yes, yeah. Truck. I thought it was out. one that was based on that film with uh, Jesse Eisenberg and Emma <laughs> Stone, and Woody Harrelson. No, I'm, I'm, no they no. they wander into a land of anime girls. <laughs> It's based off, make, wasn't it like making an idol group but with zombie girls? Yeah, I think yeah. There's some like subplot. It's very yeah. It, it it looks. I might watch it eventually. It looks quite you know cute. But uh, and the last one in uh, column three is Jujutsu Kaisen, uh, which is a series I do intend to watch. I've heard the fights are really hype and everything, but. I've not watched any. Yeah, I've heard, I, I heard, I've seen it circling around a lot. It's, it was pretty good. But, I know, um, impressively, Jujutsu Kaisen Zero, which is the movie, did, like, crazy numbers in, like, cinemas all over the world. I mean, obviously in Japan. But I think in the mm-hmm. West, it's, like, in the top ten anime movies or something. Like, in terms of gross. Mm-hmm. Which is wild, because it's quite new. Uh, right, so we're going to go off now and tally up row three and we'll be back for the final row all right we are back so we've tallied up the numbers i will begin uh as usual i am at 35 at the moment dan what are you at 14 okay tom i'm at 19 okay and tim okay Okay, well, hey. Double digits, you know? Double something, digits. Right? That something. That... I, I well, think... Thank you. Reassure me. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm a weep. I'm, uh, yeah, I, yeah. I love animus and mangoes. Yeah, honestly, Tim. G- <laughs> the way you're going, I don't think a lot of cute anime girls are going to notice you. Uh... I'm going to get scalped, aren't I? <laughs> well, talking about scalping... Um, sometimes the Egyptians might have done that, possibly, but it's too far in the past for us to really know. Uh, but Yu-Gi-Oh! is an anime that has ties to Egypt. Uh, I have seen... I've seen most of the original Yu-Gi-Oh! I've also seen yeah. season one and two of Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexel. So I'm I, I, definitely counting it. I've definitely seen a movie as well. Oh, uh, I don't know if you have. Yeah, no, I've seen all three. Um, Yu Gi Oh! The movie, Dark Side, uh, De- Duel of Fate, and Dark Side of Dimensions. Dark Side of Dimensions, the newest one, genuinely is a really fun movie. Uh, I was so good. I really. wanted to watch this when it was out in the like in the nineties or whatever two thousand. In the nineties, but uh, I didn't have like. <laughs> I only had like four channels growing up. Uh, Same. Yeah, yeah, that was my thing as well. It, it looked cool, but I never got into it. I've never seen the full episode in my whole entire life. Yeah. Well, it's a series I actually watched uh, about like 10 years ago, I think. Netflix got it. Um, but yeah, much like you, I watched, I think, two or three episodes growing up. Although, um, a fun fact, I. <laughs> Being a kid, uh, one of my fondest memories of getting a toy is getting a Blue Eyes White Dragon figure and not Aww. having a clue what it was from. Just being like, is my birthday? It was like, oh, shiny silver dragon that like fires something. Let's go. And I still have it to this day. It is a cherished figure. That's... Yeah, that's, that's very good. Did you watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridged? 
I did, oh. yeah, yeah. You you yeah, yeah. is <laughs> a lot phenomenal. Of people saw that, yeah. Uh right. Next up is Mob Cycle or Mob Cycle One Hundred. I have seen the first season of it. I haven't seen season two or three yet, but season one was phenomenal. I really, really like. Basically the TLDR of it is uh Mob is just a regular high school guy. Yeah, living in a world where people have like psychic powers, basically. Um, and he has dormant psychic powers, and they're activated when his stress level reaches 100. And so it, it's a bit of a kind of like funny, quirky anime, but then when the fight scenes happen, they are incredible. Way over the top, just sort of, oh, they're so good. Uh, what does the scout say about his stress level? It's over what? Well, uh, I mean, over 100, I, I, I don't, I don't think it can reach over one hundred. I think when it reaches oh. hundred, he goes, yeah. So, but yeah, mob psycho. Yeah, you can't get to nine thousand then. No. Yeah. Uh, next up is Tatami Galaxy. I've heard of it. I know it's an older series. Oh wait, what was it a movie? Actually, never heard of it. Um, I want to say Tatami Galaxy is a movie. Maybe I think it's a nineties or maybe an eighties show or anime i have never seen it i'm guessing you guys haven't uh no. next next up okay. is it... i thought dungeon bumper was a video game yeah well so i know it, that they is. have they have adapted like it to an anime novel, right? yeah well, i okay. that is a curious i never noticed that uh but yeah, that's a curious inclusion because explain yourself, Wolfborg. It's it's like it, including. It is an anime, though. Yeah, no, no, it is, but it's like including like the Persona anime or something. It's like, well, Final Fantasy Unlimited. Yeah, no, like... no, no, no. In uh... fairness, no, I I'm coming to the defence here. Okay. Because a lot of these are visual novels. And well, kind of yeah, novels, I guess. Yeah, novel. Steins yeah. Gate was a VN. Yeah, okay. Yeah, oh. yeah. Well, yeah. now it, I guess. Yeah, fine. Uh, right. I so n- none of us here have seen Lucky Star, I don't think. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> none, of us, none of us have seen Lucky Star. Right? No, 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 none of us. None of us. The, those cute, on, the cute Wait, lolly slow anime. Down. Slow down, slow down. I've seen Dangan Roper. Oh, have you? you? Oh, oh. God, we're going back. Oh, oh, Jesus. oh right. I sorry. I'm I, I, start, guys. I'm changing I, my mind. I have I, seen I, Dragon Ball. <laughs> I, I, sorry. No, I, no, I was trying, I was trying to say, but then Ray rushed Sorry, <laughs> no, no, I, I, sorry, I assumed you hadn't, because I, I was, I was making the funny of. Uh, anyway, go on, Danganronpa. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. It was good. It was good. I've seen, um, I've seen the first series. I think I don't know if oh. there's more. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But just uh, see tape. Right, mm-hmm. it was all right. Okay. Turned <laughs> uh, all right. It's, it's all right. Uh, next series. Oh, oh, I'm I'm setting up for Tom Zanger here. Uh, you you've seen Lucky Star, Tom? Yes. I am guessing you're the only one. It's uh, like one of yeah. the one of the first animes I watched. I I, I've I not remember s- you, that was like. Wait, no. Based- I think Gateway I saw anime. two episodes yeah. in our anime club back in school, Tom. So, mm. but uh, that not yeah, enough. It, that I'd... It's like uh, oh, what is it? Uh, four pound. What's the other one? What's the one you like, Tim? It's like uh, it's like Adamanga Dio. Ah, yeah. Did you have a lucky star bag? I did indeed. You did. (laughs) Ah, yes. With You just invoked a memory there, Dan. (laughs) (laughs) Wow. (laughs) Very, very funny series. Very Mm. funny. Right. Next up, now is time for me to flex my chadness on you guys. I've seen all of season one of Bananya. Uh, I, I don't know what that is. So, they're, they're cute four-minute episodes about bananas that have cats living in them, and all of the cats have different personalities. There's like... Wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go back. But bananas with cats living inside the... Bus- so, what? well, they're cats, but they happen to live inside bananas. Like, the girl lives inside how, a pink banana. Uh, how they fl- do you live in... No, no, like, they, fl- they float. Explain it's fine. the concept. It's fine. The bananas float. It makes sense. Uh, so... <laughs> But Wait, yeah, hold so, on, hold on. You huh? is not lying. Yeah, no, bana- this isn't that right. Bana- bana- bananas. You're not lying. I just don't understand how you. It's so it, it's ca- it yeah. It's a comedy series, and it, it's just, it's meant to be like weird. It's uh, cats that live in bananas, and the bananas float, and when they go to sleep, they close up the banana skin. Um, and the girl has a pink banana. There's a handsome banana. Oh, okay. 
And also, one of the characters, uh, one of the cats, is voiced by Naruto's voice actors. Oh. Which is uh, just really ca- caught me off guard. Uh, l- literally, you can marathon Banania season one in like an hour and a half or something. They're just four, four minute episodes of like uh, Kuroneko goes missing, who's the black cat, Banania. And then they find him when he was. Is it meant for children or like? Yeah, well, kind of. It it so in Japan it would air between anime, so like you you just finish watching Naruto Shippuden and just before. Like cleanser. Like, yeah, it was sort of like a hey, he was like a four minute little little short. It's they're, they're very comfy. On, yeah. Um, but yeah, so I just thought I'd flex on you. Uh, next up, we have Simple Gear. Uh, a series I'm aware of, but I've never seen. Um, it's nope. about kind of cybernetic girls who battle with music. Um, and I know it's notoriously difficult for localization that I think at least one, maybe two companies tried to bring it to the West, but they basically had to re-record all of the music in English. And I think they just gave up because it it's been in production hell, basically, because it's like, you, you can't, but... It it looks cool. Lots of cute girls battling while singing, I guess. Uh, I'm guessing no one else has seen it. No. Next up is Tokyo Ghoul. Everyone's heard the intro music. Uh, I've seen season one of Tokyo Ghoul. It's it's all right. Um, may, maybe it gets better down the road. It's um, it's a bit like a standard vampire anime but so it gets a bit more interesting as it goes on or whatever um and bizarrely despite the fact that sort of like the intro and everything makes it look really edgy and dark um it, it's not particularly until like near the end of the season oh. one which is oh, right. i mean it it's I d- it's dark but in terms of a sort of slice of life vampire thing. It's like there I are some fights and stuff. But... People have re- recommended Tokyo Ghoul to to me. Yeah, in, I mean, I work, but, um... I I enjoyed the first season. I think it's worth a watch if you like vampire kind of stuff. But don't expect it to be a balls to the wall kind of shown in action fighty series as I was expecting. Because oh. I was it's like more drama oriented. Yeah, than... it's. I mean, it's it's a personal drama. So like, it's it's not. It's not a slice of life. There are, you know, things going on. But yeah. Okay. Uh, next is Made in Abyss. I know it's very, very highly regarded. I haven't seen it. Uh, it's apparently very sad and dark. It looks like a bunch of kids that go on an adventure. So I don't. I don't. More know. like, more like, more like Made in Abyss. Am I right? <laughs> oh, 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 oh! I'm guessing you guys haven't seen Made in Abyss. No, I've no. seen a lot. I've seen. I always see stuff about where I think it's very popular, isn't it? Nice. Uh, right. Next up is Shiro Bako. I've. I don't even know if I've heard of it. No, I haven't. Uh, yeah. I. I'm guessing but you guys have no. Uh, white ghost or something maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'm horribly translating that. Possibly. Oh, it's. Uh, it's. I. Fi- <laughs> Judging from this, it looks like a, about a school animation club, and it's got a oh. load of girls in it. So I'm going to no. guess it's cute girls doing cute Wait, things. Wait, anime- no, it's not. This art club has a problem, is it? That's um, no, I'm guessing not. Uh, I did watch a series called This Art Club Has a Problem, uh, which, and the main character is a guy who's very skilled. Oh well, one of the main characters is a guy who's very skilled at drawing. Um, but doesn't like 3D women, only likes 2D. So, uh, legend. Chad. Unheard of. Chad Award. Next is another series I haven't heard of. Familiar of Zero. I, no, I mean, no. I don't know. I Maybe I've just missed this, but no. I, I'm guessing you guys as well. Um, hang on. Hang on. No, this rings a bell. Um... Oh, it's I've, def- I've definitely seen the main character for this. Oh. Yeah, Defo. I, it was really popular. It had like a waifu in it. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, it's a fantasy like, ah. like novel. But um, if you look it up, Brid, hmm. uh, later, you'll probably say, oh, I, yeah, I know I've seen that character. Cool. It's like a pink kid, like 
magician girl or something. Oh, yeah. I think I know the one you mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think. Um, right. Next up, uh, someone may have to Google this. Is GTO, which is great teacher. Is it ok- Okinaza? Okinaw? Ozikana? I I can't remember what his last name is, but great teacher. Onizuka. Onizuka. Yeah. There we are. Great teacher Onizuka. I've I've never watched it. I've heard good things. Um, it's it's sort of. I don't know if slice of life is the right word, but I think it's like, you know. It's quite well regarded. Never heard of it. Uh, yeah. Next up is Slam Dunk, uh, which is the basketball anime, which is the yeah. one I thought Haikyuu was. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. I know Slam Dunk had a recently mildly controversial movie because it was a movie at the end of either the series or like one of the series, but it was 3D and some people didn't oh. like it. But mm. but apparently it's one of those things that like in shots it looks a bit thing, but when you see it moving it looks a bit better. So I don't know. I have no idea what the next one is. You're no, have to, like... um, Pok Pok Pokemon. Pokemon? That's a weird one. Uh, yes, I've mm. I have seen. I think all of Indigo League. I've yeah. seen uh, X and Indigo. Y, X Y Z. Yeah, so. yeah I've seen more Sajoto, a lot of Hoenn. Dan, you've seen like, loads yeah. of Pokemon, right? Like loads yeah. of it. You... No, just literally just the Indigo. Uh, okay. you've, seen, you've seen a movie though, haven't you? Oh yeah. Oh everyone, yeah. 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 Everyone I... gets the point for Pokemon. Uh, yeah. I think if you've seen a Pokemon points. movie, that is. Yeah. That's. Uh, we don't need to. Uh, you uh, don't need to spend too long on that. Toradora. I've never seen it, but I I've heard it's fun. Guess who? Toradora. Who is what? Oh. Tom. Tom has watched the anime of the cute uh, anime high school girl. What? How? Yeah. I'm heard of. Uh, yeah, the, I, uh, that's on with Tiger. Right? Yes, it is. It is. It's uh, it's kind of it's a highly regarded one. It's hmm. um, yeah, it's really cute. Cool. It's really cute. Cool. Like a romance slice of life. It um, is on Amazon Prime Video. Uh, it was recommended to me. I'm, I, I'll, I'll watch it. It looks cute. It's um. Then she goes on to like explore and stuff, right? <laughs> Dora the Explorer. <laughs> um. Right. Next one is Clanad. I have indeed seen season one of this because uh, a friend of mine in uni really loved Clanad, so I watched season one. So what is that about exactly? Um. It's. It's based on another visual novel. It's kind of a romance slice of life. It's about a guy that goes to school and meets lots of girls. And it the anime kind of focuses a few episodes on each girl, which is basically the start of the romance route in the visual novel. But he only ends up with one of them, obviously. I know um, Clanad is actually like this Irish band. It is. And I know uh, Enya was like... A yep. member at one point. I, I'm 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 sorry to break this to you. It has no no relevance to that. Um, I I was thinking it had like, oh, is this gonna be some kind of like no. Celtic anime, you know It's very it's Japanese. Just... Uh and it's not no Enya. It's not. I've, no Enya. I've seen this. I've hey. seen yeah. Cla- Clanad is a classic. It it a, another Mid two thousands, if you happen to be on like anime piracy sites and got into chats or whatever, Clan Lad was another one that. Wait, doesn't it also have cute girls in it? And... Uh, it does actually. And, like again, Tom. Good Tom, lord, Tom, I've seen it. What there's, are... a, there's a pattern emerging here. Huh. That's curious. He's picked, wrong, he's picked the wrong girl at the end, or. Uh, oh. yeah, I can't. I can't remember the girls very well, apart from Ghost Lolly. They met at the start, and then. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, right. Next one is Black Butler. I have seen all of season <laughs> one of this. Uh, yeah. Going back to Oren Horse Club, uh, that was Yaoi. This is mega Yaoi because I mean, the the creator of Black Butler is a Yaoi artist. Uh, oh, I didn't know that. I oh yeah, yeah. She, she. I think she worked on Yaoi before and after Black. I mean, Black Butler isn't very far from Yaoi. It, it's you know, it it, it borders there. But yeah, it's uh... it's really good though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, on- like... honestly, I really like Black Butler. I've only seen season one. Mm. I hear two isn't as strong. Um... Yeah, there was definitely some weak points. We, me, me and Ridge were um, almost like kind of 
there were some girls in our anime club in school and they loved this. Yes. The, this we was made... the this is the height of oh. Yaoi fangirls. Like, yeah, they were. They were. Like, they like were. literally, we'd watch it and there'd be. Because the, the, the basic plot is Sebastian is a mysterious butler who maybe comes from hell who made a pact with a young boy CL uh, and he protects him and there's a few moments where I don't know CL will be like in danger and Sebastian will pick him up and hold him close and the girls would literally go like ah and stuff and <laughs> it, it was literally the sort of experience it is show to come well, <laughs> yeah uh, well I mean uh, there it are lots of yeah there are lots yeah. of sort of handsome men in it and stuff it, it reminds me of um, Sherlock a lot, like a little, two, yeah, a in bit. a good way, not in the bad and, ways. And <laughs> as well known for Sebastian's like. Maybe it's translation, but they're very slightly awkward. It's like, I am simply one hell of a butler. It's like, we know, Sebastian, you've said, Jesus Christ. But yeah, it's uh, he's cool, though. Next up, uh, I've heard very good things about the manga. Don't know much about the anime, which is Monster. I've not seen it, but. I, know I prefer Red Bull good. myself. Yay. Yeah. Guessing you guys haven't seen Monster. No. no. Give us a quick. Uh... Um, I don't really know much about it. I know it's a really highly regarded manga, but I think it's about. Um, I think it's a boy is born with like a weird curse thing where he turns into a pigeon. No, a monster, and it, it's it's a bit Doctor Jekyll and Mister Hyde from my understanding, or it could be thinking now, of a different thing. If it was a pigeon, I could definitely oh. get behind that. Yeah. Give me some hatful boyfriend. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, I'm glad I didn't read this list. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. oh God! That yes, no, the, no, this is the no. moment. Oh, this is all worth it. I don't care if I lose now. Right. <clears throat> <clears throat> Next up is Oremo. Now you might not recognise that name, so I'll give you the English translation. My little sister can't possibly be this cute. No. Oh. Now, oh. I haven't watched this series yet. Uh, Has anyone here? No one here has so, watched it, Tim, surely. Tim, you've... No, oh. you haven't watched it. Wait. I, I haven't. I, Wait, I, I, I Dan, possibly. you... No, Dan. Dan, you no. haven't watched it. I... Definitely Who... So none of us have watched it, then. Who was it? I'm sure there was someone. I can't think of who it was. Hmm. Surely it couldn't be anyone here, though, right? Could, could. Look, 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 right? <laughs> I, I, could, I could say no and not get the point. Uh, I could. That's my decision here. Do I say no and not get the it's point? It's too late, isn't it? Let's be honest. Uh, right. Well, yeah, I've seen it, and honestly, like, it was funny. I guess the verdict. Like, Tom, could his little sister be that cute? She, she's cute. She's kind of a bitch, oh, yeah. though. Um, I haven't seen <laughs> season two. See she's that. Cute. See that's why. Uh, patricians don't watch that. They watch Arrow Manga Sensei. Yeah, yeah, and they're in a shared universe, Red. Exactly. Uh, they're the... in each other's anime, so... Yeah, the oh. the Siscon universe, cinematic universe. <laughs> uh, <laughs> right, uh, next up, I, I've not watched it, but heard good things about it, Nichi Joe. I've... What? Oh. It's sort See, of in that same circle as, like, Lucky Star, right? Am I right in saying? Yeah, yeah, it's like Lucky Star now as a manga Dio. I've seen... How much of it have I seen? I don't think I've watched the series, unfortunately. Nah. Um, okay. But I've watched a good 10 or 12 episodes, but I can't count it, unfortunately. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, it, it's another mid-2000s, like, staple. Uh, I, I know the, the... No, 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 um... it's, a, it's later than that. It oh, is out... it? Also, yeah, yeah, we're yeah, using the cool. word mid, right? Oh, <laughs> I, I'm pretty um, sure it came out like the 20th. I'm not. Can't I, confirm. I want to say Nichi Joe as well. Isn't that the one where the ending is like shots of scenery and the girls are dancing and they like move around where they're dancing? It, it was like a meme format for a while, I think. I, I think I remember the one you were on about, yeah. Um, let me check the anime came out. It came out in 2011. There you go. Oh, okay. More recent than I thought then. Yeah. Next up, I'm giving myself a point, is Kakegurui. Um, which uh, so I've seen season one of you might recognise it as the sort of horny gambling anime 
No, that doesn't ring a bell, right? It's about the girl with long black hair who loves gambling, but I argue would argue loves gambling a little bit too much. Um, oh. It's it's i don't think i don't think i'd say it's trashy because i think the whole point is it's meant to be the kind of juxtaposition of gambling and like sexual gratification but have you seen it tom no i haven't it's not that trashy then it's not that trashy it's uh so it's on netflix i don't think there was an earlier kakigurui thing i think it was a manga Mm. but yeah it's she's a long a uh, black-haired girl who she's known for doing the pose where she puts the hand over her face and she's blushing and like in- enjoying herself and her fetish is gambling i guess i don't know it's it, it's it's pretty good it's not a, an anime i'd want to watch with people <laughs> uh, um next up is gintama now i've seen the first four episodes of gintama which is nowhere near a series so i'm not counting it but i do know uh, people really love it. It's basically parody bleach, sort of. It's. Oh. I, I want to say TT Kubo may have had some involvement in it, but basically. Oh really? Oh, uh, or maybe he had something to do with like character design or something. So basically, it's sort of a shonen anime, so, and it's long running, but it's all about gags. Like it's all it's just a comedy. There's not really serious. I think there are some serious like bits or whatever, but. The whole point is it's a shonen parody, so sort of, you know, the getting lots of scrapes and stuff. I watched the first four episodes, very funny, I just never finished it. Um, but that's that, that's like a classic. Um, next up is TQ. Have you heard of it? No. Okay, I'll have a quick look at TQ. Uh, TQ. Where are you teaking me? <laughs> it's a sports uh oh, anime. What oh, sport okay. is it? Hang on. Tennis club. <laughs> oh wait, is it Prince of Tennis? No. No, that's I've not. Got, that's... I've got no 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 no, 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 no. Okay, no, Prince of Tennis is an older one. In fact it looks like it's girls, just like a Oh girls, oh, oh right, oh Prince of Tennis definitely is not girls. It's only boys. Uh and talking about only boys? Uh, which uh, is how I many people Naruto had kissed until Hinata, I guess. Uh, <laughs> next up is... I mean, I'm not wrong. You're not wrong uh, at all. Uh, next up is Naruto. Uh, I have obviously seen all of Naruto. I have and Shippuden. seen all of... I've seen all of regular Naruto. I hmm. gave up halfway through Shippuden. Understandable. Um, Tom, I know, is a big fan as well. I think. Oh, yeah. Co- How much you, Naruto have you seen? I think Tom? you caught up with Boruto as well, aren't you, Tom? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've seen the sum total of no Naruto, I'm afraid. So. It, I know, yeah. it, it was a running joke, though, that you dislike Naruto with a burning passion, but I don't My, know like, why. Favourite memory of Naruto is not even anything to do with the series itself. It's when we got a hold of Tom's Facebook <laughs> and started an event saying. There was also um I don't think you guys are there for this, but during anime club uh in school, by by sheer coincidence, I'd been down into town um before dinner time and I'd bought volume one of Naruto on DVD, the the Zabuza arc basically. And and as Tom left the room I like just the jigsaw pieces fell into the thing. It's like, guys, guys, we need to stop what we're watching right now. And I put the first disc in and we started watching Naruto and Tom walked in. It's like, what? What the fuck is this, guys? That was fun. Um, Haku is best girl. Yeah, Haku is best girl, easily. Um, You know, I I hope her and Zabuza. Uh, If it helps, I've eaten Naruto. There you go. Um, So, Tom. Dan, if you want to look up the food variety list, we'll do that next episode. <laughs> okay. uh, right, and the last one. So this is going to be my wild, crazy statement. I haven't seen Perfect Blue. Um, no, oh. I've heard of you. Good what? thing. Yeah. No. Dan, you've seen it, right? No. I'm the only one who's seen Perfect Blue. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't even think of that. But yeah, no, that's that's another one that you. What, yeah. what is it about then? Uh, Perfect Blue is basically what um, they ripped off to make um, Black Swan. 
it's, it's directed by Satoshi Kon as well. Yeah, who is well it regarded. Is. It's fantastic. It's very trippy. Um, it's it's like the quintessential trippy anime movie to watch. Um, and yeah, it's it's visually, uh, I got more out of it than Akira, and that's just well, my right. personal opinion. Oh, I I remember. Um, the, I know this director did Paprika. And yeah, I yeah, haven't yeah. seen yes. Paprika, but that's I right. remember watching like some sort of video where they were saying, right, this director, but you don't probably don't know him, but. You know, he's inspired. Yeah, Hollywood, I mean, like, like Inception. Inception um, and Paprika are shockingly similar. Te- really, technically speaking, I don't think there's as much case with Paprika, just because whilst it is dreams coming to real life and affecting the world, I think, I think it it's enough of a sci-fi concept that. Like, oh yeah, but those like those. But, per, but perfect blue. Swan and perfect blue. Yeah, it's, I, it's it's too much. Like it's yeah. They've just been like, what if this was like a Hollywood movie? Yeah, I've I've heard and uh, blows it up the water, and everyone talks so much like good stuff about Black Swan, and it's like just, it, 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 you you get ten times more out of it if you just watch Perfect Blue. It's, we 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 should definitely do a uh, yeah. meetup to watch this one because we like yeah. um, the one we watched the Christmas a couple of times there was oh Tokyo Godfather. Godfather. Godfather's so good so, and uh, yeah. if any but... of you watching want to come along and watch the movies with us you can't because that would be weird uh, right we're gonna go <laughs> off and tally the last uh, last column now and we'll be right back all right we are back we've tallied it up and it's time. For the final one. So, I my final tally is actually lower than I expected. And that is 44. Uh, that's respectable. Know. That is... Uh, yeah, yeah, that, that's, that's decent, I think. But I was expecting it to be higher, to be honest. But a lot of these series threw me for a loop. Either because they're literally series I started watching a little bit of. Or... Well, like we were saying, because it's so varied, I think mm. it would be very... You'd have to be like a super human to like yeah. seen more than like half of these i reckon so mm. i think 44 is a very respectable score mm, you're a weeb nice. yeah hey, well i mean but am i a chad weeb we'll have to find, out. find out dan what's your final tally i got 15 out of 100 so okay well i mean you know that that uh, we'll, we'll, could, we'll... there's room for improvement there's room for improvement but i think it's it's enough to say that you are into anime and no yeah. anime, you know. You, I agree. You, yeah. It's double digits. You're not yeah. a normie. You're not a normie. No, it, it's not yeah. a like. Oh, I I remember like Dragon Ball when I was a kid. You know, it's you you definitely yeah. ascended past that. Uh, yeah. Tim, what is your final score? Thirteen. I mean, not, unlucky for some. Not far off, actually. You and Dan are very like neck and neck then in terms. Uh, the thing is, there's like I'm disappointed they didn't have Berserk on here. I would uh, uh, no, if we could pick and choose which anime we're yeah, on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, much higher scores. Yeah, it's, I uh... feel I feel like it's a good like slice of like every yeah. genre type. Yeah, of anime. it is, yeah. and like eras as well. What I really like yeah. is that like yeah. you, like you'll get the like current hotness, the like lit AF series, but you'll also get the like eighties ones. The like ooh. All right, Grandad. I'm, I'm I'm curious when this was done because there aren't any like for the no last. No, my family. Year. Which... Yeah, yeah. No, I think yeah. For the last year, there's nothing for the last year on, so I think I, this is well, somewhat old. We are too old. I, old. Not that old, but I think as old. well, though, a lot of these do tend to seem to be legacy anime. So even Jujutsu Kaisen or Demon Slayer are like they're new, but they've built such a like. Yeah, you know. Whereas I think Spy Family is big, but I think hasn't quite mm. reached like certified hood classic yet. You know. Well, Although know. it's a classic in our eyes. Well, mm. I guess. Anyway, I just think it was right. when it was written. Probably. Yeah. Uh, Tom, anyway, what is yeah. your final? What's, what's your score? What's yours? I, I, I got twenty-seven. So that's good. That, yeah, that that's that's, that's over a quarter there. That's but like you know. You know what that means. Rid. Well, wow. the certified weeb. Yay! Yay. We I, are. I don't know if, if that means anything to you, but I think you should wear it as a badge of. I should. I, what, what I'm going to do. What I'm going to do is That's I'll true. buy an Ahigao uh, hoodie or T-shirt soon, 
Uh, I'm waiting for the weather to get warm enough, obviously, for me to just wear a t-shirt out, and I'll, I'll walk around town with that. I think you should. To, to assert my, my weeb dominance. Yes. Uh, and no, so I that, enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. No, sorry, right. Tom. We'll find a hentai one next time. <laughs> Yeah, that's, come on, man. That's gonna be a that's gonna be a comfortable few hours, I, mean, I think. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win that one, guys? I'm not sure. sure. Hmm. 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 Uh, so, what what did everyone think of Legend of the Overfiend? And uh, and then Tom can go on for twenty minutes. It's like, well, I thought uh, I thought the uh, the tentacle scenes were a little bit, you know, a little bit much. But uh, you know, let's all just pick categories we know we're gonna win in. Yeah. Tell you what, next time I'll do the um, what is your imminent tortoise anime score, uh, <laughs> and then all hundred will be a series I've watched. And um, yeah, no, um, yeah. Well, Tim, that also means uh, you're the the. I was about yeah. to say. I was about to say. Just give it to me straight. Just give it to me straight. Uh, I was about to say that <laughs> that means you're a weeb virgin, but that just sounds like bullying. That that just <laughs> feels like something that. We've all been called in the past online <laughs> on various forums, and if uh, anything, it's, it's the reverse. I know too much. Yeah. Of of non weeb thing. Exactly. Yeah. So yeah, what's, yeah. The, yeah. Um, what's the what's the what well, in in Fortnite they call themselves the uh, default. Is it, yeah. Is that, yeah. I mean, because they got default skins. Don't call me a fucking default. That's worse than a virgin. Um. <laughs> right. Well, I'm going to end it here. Um. Thank you guys for joining me. <laughs> Sadly, Tom is waylaid. He's taking a food delivery. Um, but we'll he be should back be again. A delivery of fucking good anime. But oh, uh, we'll be doing another talk toys very soon. And by soon, I mean twenty twenty five. So keep I an eye out. Will we? For <laughs> that. Well, next time we'll do a countdown of of two hundred anime. Also, yeah. we'll do listen toys soon. Yeah, we will. We'll we'll we'll, we'll, we'll we'll do it as regular as we do talk toys. So um, so until until then, happy New Year, Merry Christmas, uh, happy birthday if your birthday happy happens, Monica. you know, between now and next year. Uh, yeah, and I'll leave you all get on. Thank you guys very much for watching, and until next time, goodbye. goodbye.